Hello everyone. I hope you find yourself having a great day. I've got a nice little piece of software to review with you today called Software Data Cable. And what Software Data Cable is going to allow you to do is move media, videos, photos, from your Android smartphone to your computer. Uh, it's compatible with, compatible with Windows, Linux, uh, Mac. It's very easy to do. Once you've installed Software Data Cable, you'll configure it and you'll be working with this over your local area network. Once it's installed, it'll give you an FTP address and a port number, and you'll simply type that in through Finder or Windows Explorer. We'll launch the uh, Software Data Cable website. You can see that it's a free application. Again, you can download in the Android market. Once you've got it installed, uh, from Windows, open up Windows Explorer, and from the address bar up top, type in your FTP address that uh, Software Data Cable provides you once you launch it. Because I'm on a Mac right now, uh, I'm going to launch Finder. And what you'll do is you'll go up top under Go, connect to server. Once you click that, it'll give you an address area to connect to server. Uh, I've already typed mine in, which is a local area network here. FTP colon slash slash 192.168.1.193 colon 8888. And the 8888 is the uh, port number that I chose to forward on my router. So make sure you have access to your router to configure ports and port 40. Once you've got that information typed in, click connect. I'm connected as a guest. And you'll see here we have just that simple. We've got uh, all of our files and folders on our Android phone. And you can go right into these and copy them from your phone to a location on your computer or vice versa if you've got files on your computer that you wish to uh, put on your smartphone you can simply copy and paste them here uh, I'm by default set to my uh, uh, DCMI folder on my phone which is my SD card and you can configure all that information within the uh, software data cable uh, application on your phone uh, that way you can drop yourself right into an area where you want to uh, easily navigate to uh, you've got the DCMI which is uh, a, a default folder on the uh, most smartphones and uh, within that I've got set up a photos folder and uh, other things that I commonly access or need access to moving from my phone to my computer and vice versa so I hope that helps you guys and hope you find it uh, useful remember if you like please comment rate and subscribe and we'll talk to you later Bye-bye.